what is the difference between religion and spirituality religion is all about what we have seen dogmas beliefs and certain principles we also believe that all religions as god is everywhere god knows everything is omnipotent omniscient and omnipresent these are all belief system dogmas are very rigid things hindu who worships krishna is is the only one problem with hinduism is being polytheistic believes in everything and it comes from very well substantiated experiences of the sages who in vedic times felt the presence in everything so they found it apt to worship everything the mountains the trees the sky animals other human beings and they could not differentiate because they could not help but experience things in everything but today we worship cows and buffaloes and trees and sky and everything without experiencing and that is creating problems that makes you very rigid about the whole thing without experiencing you are approaching and we do things and we remain satisfied though they did it we are doing it what is the difference the difference is there the experience that's the main thing we don't have the experience problem with monotheistic religions abrahamic religions christianity judaism islam we are the best no one is better that ego is there say unfortunately the believe all religion believes in externalizing the presence of god he is in the temple he is in tirupati he is in dwarka he is in kashi he is in the temples in the mosques churches temples nothing wrong with it but one day he left to internalize that external presence what happens when we do visit temple you wait for 2 hours right or 3 hours and if you are vip maybe in 2 minutes you go to in front of the gods or goddess striking example is tirupati people wait for 2 hours in lines to enter the temple and moment they enter the temple what happens you are standing in front and your eyes close for whom you waited for 2 hours your eyes closes what are you trying to do there you are trying to feel the presence in your heart try to feel something in your heart which you could have done at home and some people become so emotional they throw money they throw gold chain they throw bracelets does god require any bracelets from you and think over it does he take it to heaven only the priests and the trust they'll enjoy all this and you do all this against the will and wishes of your family that is the situation of religion and much worse we are indoctrinated how that if you don't do this these are the repercussions you might go to hell and if you do this well you might be rewarded with heaven and then all religion says that see everything they say don't do this don't do this don't do this why so that you can get all that you didn't do here up there these are all tricks of the trade that is religion spirituality now whatsoever is said as a belief system that he is everywhere is omniscient is omnipotent you experience that in spirituality so spirituality is not about belief but spirituality is actually actualizing the belief into experience god is everywhere through spiritual practices you can feel the presence everywhere starting first with yourself that yes i can feel his presence there is no denial of it 
and then when you see that presence and also witness the presence in others and everything else that surrounds us, then the dependency on the actual thing just drops off. You don't need the crutches when you can walk on your own. You don't need a wheelchair when you can walk on your own. When you can experience God, why must you adopt external means then, see? So spiritual people are generally understood as some people against religion. But that is not the case. They are much ahead. They have transcended the belief system. Religious people are happy with the belief system. For I believe in God, it is sufficient. But deep down in your heart, do you really think your belief is good enough? What have you done with your belief? Spiritually, they said, I have seen the sun, I have seen the stars, I have seen the flowers, I have seen the river. I don't need to believe in stars and sky and flowers and rivers because I don't need the belief because I see things. I don't need to believe in God because I experience the presence. See, this is a drastic difference with a religion and spirituality. In spirituality, you personally experience. In religion, pundits do it on your behalf. They will recite some slokas which you don't even understand. <laughs>